everybody, it's Dr. Ron. You are here because you want to learn about this thing right here. This looks really cool. Uh, this is this is a leek plant. Uh, it's um, it's very interesting, right? So, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Dr. Cheng Ron, board certified board certified internal medicine physician, and I enjoy food as my medicine. So I'm gonna feature leeks today. And so, um, for those of you watching the replay, thanks for watching the replay. For those of you who are live, welcome. For those of you who want to join me live, make sure that you turn your notifications on in the top right corner so that you can follow me live. You get notifications that I get live on your phone. So this is this is a really cool thing. This is this is a leak. I grew up with this. Um, and uh, the Chinese version is actually a little bit smaller, a little more slender. Um, but the, the flavor profile is a little more intense. But... Um, but this is the traditional leak that you get here in America. Um, so a lot of there's a lot of health benefits with this. And if you would just please share this on your feed right now so everybody can learn. Because I'm going to tell you uh, a few things about how to um, cook this leak. And some very important things that this does for our, our health and our kind of cardiovascular system. So I'm just gonna jump right into it. And let me just share this on my feed right now. Just hold on one second, I'm gonna share this on my feed so that everybody can learn. There we go, I shared it on my Twitter. <clears throat> okay, let's jump right into it. So this is great, um, leaks are, are awesome. Leaks um, have a lot of properties about them and uh, they're delicious and I'm gonna tell you ways to cook them that are gonna be delicious. But one of the first things that uh, leaks do is uh, right when it enters your body, you, get, you absorb um, this um, you absorb this chemical uh, from the leak, and what it does is stimulates nitric oxide from being, from uh, re uh, release inside your blood vessels. So what nitric oxide does is it dilates your blood vessels. So why do we want our vessels blood vessels to be dilated? Well, nitric oxide. Is intrinsic in our blood vessels, and once it dilates, um, we're able to lower our blood pressure, and that's why it's super important. And how is it able to do this? Um, leaks contain a compound that deactivates another compound that deactivates <laughs> nitric oxide, so there's a higher level of nitric oxide in our uh, in our vessel walls. So um, that by itself has a tremendously awesome effect. Um, but um, there's a few other things that could be pretty important too. So leeks also have a lot of uh, folic acid. And fo folic acid is a vitamin that's uh, needed for the support of brain and cardiovascular health, or, or heart health as well. And so by leeks lowering um, our blood pressure, helping lower our blood pressure, and by leeks uh, having, the nitri um, having the folic acid, uh, it supports our cardiovascular health overall and it's fantastic for uh, vegetables. And uh, it also has something called uh, antioxidants or uh, plant polyphenols. And these plant polyphenols are involved in the anti-aging process. So I'm pretty mesmerized by this right now because I'm about to chop it up pretty finely and cook it. So uh, antioxidants are super important because it decreases the amount of inflammation that we have in our body, uh, in our blood vessels. So it, um, by decreasing the amount of inflammation, it has, it's less likely for plaques and everything to build up into our blood vessel walls, causing it to shut off and causing strokes and heart attacks and stuff like that. So, yeah, I mean, these the three mechanisms of how leeks really protect the body I think is super important. I think it's a great vegetable to have. So, how do you cook this sucker? Um, leeks absorb um, everything that, um, every, every flavor they kind of throw at it. So you, you're able to chop um, this very finely and then stir fry it um, into like a sesame oil, which has a really strong flavor. Um, and from the, the entirety from the stem all the way to the leaves can be eaten. And, uh, or you can use that into a stew or a soup, uh, once again, chop very finely. And the reason I want you to chop very finely is because, I don't know if you can see, but this is pretty stiff right here. And when it's real stiff like this, that means that it's got a lot of fiber. Fiber is good for your body, but uh, it's hard to chew. So make sure you chop it very, very finely. Um, and, and leeks can also be put in as a, as a topping in different soups. 
And you can also put it into some pestos. Um, so if you have, I, I like to make um, this particular pesto um, with pine nuts and um, um, my mind is going blank. And pistachios. It's a pine nuts and pistachios pesto with, uh, with leeks and parsley. So, and I also have some parsley here too that I bought. I just went to Whole Foods. That's why I get all my uh, produce because it's really close to my house. So yeah, real interesting sort of thing. Um, later on, after I cook this, I'm going to post a picture of, uh, of the leeks and so you guys can see it too. But go ahead and share this post if you think leeks are interesting. If you have anything that you use leeks for, uh, go ahead and put it in the comments below so I can learn, so I can start making these dishes. All right, thanks a lot.